Hi. Uh, we're a group of developers on the egos. So we're going to talk about new market and new tools we're interested in this future. Um, more particularly, the city has developed. probably make a lot of money working for the art center. And we all know that there's a, another level of activity. There's kind of this underground activity, this formalized uh, persona, let's say. So why not have a hidden mahjong gambling table? <laughs> you know, for the real games. Um, it could also be pai gao, uh, roulette, you know, so that it's not thinking about this as just like one game upscale atmosphere in the night market where you have a cart that you could roll out to where food vendors are and deploy and you could have points of view that are represented. And then I think the last part, you know, is getting to be quite sophisticated. So I don't know whether you're going to be able to play that out more. But I think that's kind of, that's an interesting intellectual question. And a whole lot of vendors and a whole lot of trash and not a whole lot of trash cans. B is the uh, trash act, trash reform, and trash port group. <laughs> Uh, our project begins with a series of observations about the night market. Uh, the first of these has to do with sort of the raw feelings of the numbers in the place. Um, and by smartly transitioning between these pads, we can work the trash towards the trash can at the periphery. Now, what is that? So this is a uh, GPS locator, um, which is actually working in, in this trash ball in the house. As you get close. Oh. Oh. As you get close to a trash can, it notifies you that you are very close to a trash can. Um, so, it's yeah, actually, the trash can is going to bow or These are trash balls that are randomly generated, they're randomly floating through the crowd, um, but towards the nearest trash can. Um, something like this, uh, where you have a, a sort of your trash, uh, your pleasant clean trash encased inside uh, this sort of this plastic material. To receive it, to use it, um, pass it on, and then how to empty the, the ball. <laughs>
So our project is focused on the Main Tees Riverside Park. Um, it's a big open park. Um, I think we're all familiar with it by now. Um, more of a sense of connection between all the spaces. So in developing this concept, this was a, an early sketch that we came up with the, for this idea. Um, the idea is to have a field of lights that flows across the space. A later rendering of, of the same idea where we reverse the direction of flow the lights are beginning on this side and blowing up that side you might be able to catch some. <laughs> uh, so the simulation doesn't represent uh, the chasers yet. Um, Right, you sit down, that triggers the effect downstairs. This person, just the few people that are there, it's never more than one or two. 